Lucifer is the known uh, as the morning Sirius? star. Sirius? No, no, no. Lucifer is known as the morning star. Okay. Okay. Yes. How bright are you? There's, there's, I would show you if I could put it up. I would explain it. I would show you it. Yes. So Lucifer is known as the morning star. It's funny because they interchange Jesus and Lucifer so much, so much. And everybody gets it in their head that this is this and this is this. But then that's duality for you. Um, the, 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 this parasitic consciousness that, that, that um, rules here doesn't care what you buy into. It doesn't care if you buy into this religion, that religion, any religion. As long as you buy into it and as long as you put everything you've got into it, that's, they're fine with that. Because it then maintains this dual fighting thing. Like, you know, you're wrong, I'm right, you're wrong, I'm right, bat, or like this. And by doing that, it maintains the dual. Everything is vibrating, right? Whoa, 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 like vibrating like this. So to maintain a 3D vibrational state, you have to have um, count. Yes, you have. Well, you have to have. You have to make sure that you have um, black and white, and uh, you have to have two things fighting against each okay. other. If there weren't two things fighting against each other, this would cease to be uh, solid anymore. It would. It would raise its vibration, and, and we wouldn't be stuck here. So it's imperative for this particular consciousness to maintain war or disagreement at all times. Mm -hmm. uh the war on Mars, thousands of years ago, yeah. what was it about? It's the same war that's going on now. And it's... Um, it's like between the reptilians and, yeah. and mammals? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And never ending, you know? Because they are, they are totally opposing genetically. You couldn't get more diametrically opposed beings. They are completely opposite. And to make things worse, the um, this 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 body that we have now um, was deemed to be the most efficient uh, body to function on surface Earth. But what they did is they they for the majority ninety nine percent is they gave us only two two stream DNA, mm -hmm. reptilian and mammalian DNA which don't fit. So that's why everybody is walking around. Uh, uh, at, at odds with themselves inside because they don't go together. Mm -hmm. This was done on purpose to maintain the duality because, because, they, they, because they don't mix. We're always walking around, um, you know. And also the aspect of uh, male and female. Yes. The reptilians don't have that. Yeah, because well, they did that to split. Originally, originally, um, the the uh, you know how did they pro procreate? The 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 split from male to female was to give the desire of sexuality, to 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 um to 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 like to be complete. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Because when when a male and female get together in in that way, it creates a third energy. If it's done, so but if it's inverted. You can create like extremely negative, negative, negative power. Um, if sexuality is done with violence or um, or, or anger or you know like like it, it can be used very, very, very you know, negatively. If it's done with love and compassion and kindness, mm -hmm. it's the most powerful um, energy in the universe. Mm -hmm. They know this. That's why all the all the stuff they use do is is with sex magic, mm -hmm. and Crowley introduced and refined sex magic in the tw in the twentieth century. And this negative sexuality mm. is um, also like kind of a betrayal, which uh, breaks the absolutely heart. absolutely. So each each thing that they do is is, is another offshoot of an attack on the heart. Everything they're doing is, is an, an attack on the heart. Uh, it's very calculated, it's very contrived. It's slowly, slowly, slowly sticking pins here, 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 here until they take it over, which they're not going... They already lost. Mm -hmm. They already lost. So the storyline is over, but we're just playing it out. So when? I don't know time. So they lose. But uh, when they lost they? on Mars? Well, if, or? First of all, if you remember, there is no such thing as time. Okay. <laughs> so uh, my, that is, it's, it's critical that you understand okay, that. Okay, they, they lost, so why do they still play that? Because they like it. Okay. 
They like the game. Yes. This down here, they even call it the game. Uh huh. Do you know why? Because there's nothing like pleasures of the flesh. There's nothing else in on the. There's no other incarnation on this in this universe where you can get the pleasures you can. And I mean, you say that people say that um, you know, in these high frequencies, these that um, the 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 feelings that you get are you know uh, bliss, but. but if you're in a physical 3D flesh body and you're also experiencing these things, there there isn't anything comparable to it. So they like it. So what they want to do is they want to have, they want to keep this body, stay in this body for et eternity, and um, have uh, a thousand year Reich that is coming up of peace, mm -hmm. and then start again, start the war again and start war again for a thousand years and then stop and have peace for a thousand years and they want and that's how they want to do it continually mm -hmm. yeah and not and not age because if they age and die then then they have to start fa then they have to face um some things that they've done <laughs>